third gen Tacoma here, um, TRD off-road. Just installed installed some Nitro 29 gears and an Eaton e-locker in the front differential. So this one has the factory rear e-locker, as you all know. Um, so we're gonna do a functionality test. Currently the truck is in two-wheel drive and the Eaton e-locker is disconnected. So front tire's off, spin one tire, has no effect on that other tire. Rear tire's on the ground. Spin the tire does not affect the drive line. So open diff, ADD disconnected. Now, we're gonna come in here. We're going to engage four wheel drive. Now here's the tricky thing about these Eaton e-lockers. You'll see how they work. So, we're in four wheel drive. Now I can rotate this tire and it rotates the other tire, but in the opposite direction. So it's in, the ADD is connected, but we are in four wheel drive, which means the ring and pinion are not turning. So it's the spider gears that are turning, which are spinning in the opposite direction. So this is just a standard four wheel drive setup. Now, the th weird thing is with these things, we're going, this button right here activates the Eaton e-locker. Come over here, rotate the tires. As you can see, they're doing the same thing before because an Eaton e-locker needs to have a, needs to move forward or backwards for it to engage. So for us to simulate that, what we'll do is put the vehicle into two wheel drive. Okay, two wheel drive. Now we're gonna come under here and we're gonna simulate us moving forward. We're gonna rotate the front drive line till that tire turns. So that tire turns, as you can see that one does not. So our ADD is disconnected, but the e-locker is. So, now watch this. We go over here, oh, four high. Connected. What's flashing? I'm sure we get it. There it is. Okay. Now we are in four wheel drive and the front diff is locked. Now we rotate the front tire. Only goes so far because now we're binding up on the ring and pinion. So that means we are locked. We have a locked front differential. Do it on this side. Locked front differential. That is just the movement of the spider gears and the distance between the ring and pinion as well, but. And then we can come over here, push this button right there. The e-locker disconnected. And just like that, open differential, but we are still in four wheel drive. So it affects the other tire, but it spins in the opposite direction. And then we'll just go ahead and pop that into two wheel drive. There we go. And no effect on the other front drive line. ADD disconnected. No movement of the front drive line. Standard two-wheel drive. So there you have it. Eat an e-locker. Functionality test.